Hey everybody, this is Dead Winter Dead with another Battlefield 4 video for you. Today we're going to be talking about Mantle. What the heck is Mantle? Now in the latest patch for Battlefield 4, the one that gave us the DMR buffs and some other gameplay improvements, it was a turnkey activation of the AMD technology known as Mantle. Mantle is a low-level API, which stands for Application Processing Interface. It's very similar to Direct3D, very similar to OpenGL, and basically what it does is it allows GPUs that use AMD's graphics core next architecture to basically speak directly to the game or have the game speak directly to the, or the, the GPU and allow for a more pleasant, smoother gameplay. Um, basically what you see on the screen becomes a lot smoother. You're going to see less FPS drops, less micro stuttering, less texture corruption. Um, and by texture corruption, I mean, you know, texture flickering, or if you remember on Gold Mud Railway, if you were up in the sky and you looked down at the ground and there was that weird checker, checkerboard pattern on the ground, that should be eliminated. And this is, this is because of this Mantle technology. Now, obviously Mantle is, um, is a piece of, uh, a piece of software that is, uh, developed and owned by a company known as AMD. AMD, as many of you know, won the PS4 contract, so there is an AMD APU inside the PS4, and there are many, many PC builds out there that utilize AMD products and hardware. Now, <clears throat> basically the way it works, like I said, is it allows games to speak directly to the GPU to kind of eliminate bottlenecking and eliminate... Or, or not, not eliminate, but basically propagate faster draw calls from the GPU. So it basically allows the game to run faster. Which, and if the game runs faster, it runs smoother, and it translates to a much prettier picture on your screen, so to speak. Now I know I may be oversimplifying this, but but most of us out there aren't. You know, we we're not software programmers, so we can't. I'm not going to get into the nuts and bolts of it. And frankly, I don't know the all of the inner workings of this. I do tinker around with PCs a lot, so I do know a lot about GPUs and CPUs and stuff like that, and a lot of the software that goes along with the you know the two giant GPU companies, AMD and Nvidia. But you know, Mantle is, is basically a new technology, and we'll have to see what it does for us. Now, supposedly, we should see between an 8.5 and a 10 percent increase in our graphic fidelity. Basically, you know, faster. You know, more frames per second, less micro stuttering, and less texture corruption. And that boils down to basically a prettier picture and a more pleasant experience while you're playing the game. For those of you who care, um, the <coughs> PC title Star Citizen, which is currently in development, and I believe should be released in 2015, will be using, uh, will have Mantle support. Uh, Thief, which is an upcoming title, which should be coming out January 25th, 2014, will also be supported by Mantle, and it's reported that there are another 15 to 20 games, including Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare, which will have Mantle support out of the box. There shouldn't have to be a post patch to kind of activate this piece of software. It should just work as soon as you buy it out of the box, so to speak. It should work and have Mantle support, obviously, as long as you have an AMD graphics processing unit that is equipped with the graphics core next architecture. Well anyway guys I hope you uh, were able to kind of clear some things up about what Mantle was. I've been reading on the forums a lot of people have no idea what it is to them it's just some fancy name that sounds cool but they really don't know what it means to them. So the long and the short of it is it's going to make a, a more pleasant gaming experience. Higher FPS's, um, a lower likelihood of F FPS drops, it should eliminate micro stuttering and it should eliminate most texture corruptions. Now obviously this is a new piece of software which means there are going to be bugs so will it work the way AMD and uh, DICE are predicting it should work within the Frostbite 3 engine? Who knows? We shall see in the future. But there you go. That's my quick rundown on Mantle. If you guys like this please give me a thumbs up, pass it on. My name is Dead Winter Dead. Thanks for watching.